Hello, my name is Pedro Jimenez, and I'm a member of First United Methodist Church of Orlando, and I'm a Stephen minister. I remember my first time when I came here with my sister. I came in the opposite entrance to the gathering space, and I remember looking up and seeing all of the different floors, the second and the third floor, and I said, wow, God is really capable of doing some great things here at this church. And this was my first time arriving. So when I became a member, the same day, I immediately decided to pledge my tithe. And the reason being is because as one of the youth here at this church, I really am passionate about advocacy. I remember a specific sermon when Dr. Reverend Vance was preaching here in this very same courtyard uh, in the early days of COVID. And as he was preaching about John the Baptist, right on top of this very fountain, I saw a bird descend. And it started to play in the water and it was chirping. And where there is life, there's still hope. And First Church is still here in the center of Orlando, and it's still alive. That's why I give and I tithe. We young people care about activism a lot. And giving your tithes and offerings is one way to do so that isn't just sharing a post on Facebook or retweeting a black square. This is a tangible way to make a difference. First Church is on its way of becoming a, not just an accepting congregation, but a affirming congregation. And I really appreciate that. I would like to imagine that on that great day when the Lord resurrects all of us and those people standing behind the camera in the columbarium, that the current, that everyone will look upon the current generation of this church and we will see what have we done as a church here in our community and in our world. Or, you know, all of that failing, we could just buy some new fog machines. I would love some fog machines in the contemporary service. Maybe some strobe lights too. <laughs>